What's happening, guys? How you doing today? Hope you're well. Uh, in today's video, I will be reacting to uh, Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Yeah, from a little band called BTS. And it's off of an album called Wings. And Wings, I will be doing a live album reaction to on Twitch this Sunday. So I'd like to do it here on YouTube, but YouTube just insta blocks all that stuff. So I have to do it over on Twitch. So if you're interested in that, I do have my Twitch link down in the description. And if you can't make it, hey, don't worry about it. All my reactions get uploaded to Patreon uh, directly after. I get like 50 plus BTS reactions and all the albums and whatnot. So check it out if you haven't already. And um, I'm excited to get to this one because at the end of my stream I did today, uh, yeah, we, we, we sat down for the uh, August D mixtape. That, uh, that, was, that was a trip. And um, at the end of that stream, they showed me these seven videos. Yeah, these seven little teaser videos um, that somehow tie into the BU. Super artsy. Incredibly creepy, uh, but what was fascinating to me is there was little snippets of uh, some of the music off of the Wings album. And I gotta say, I'm impressed with some of the dynamics that I heard, and I can't wait to check it out. But we're here to talk about Blood, Sweat, and Tears here today. Um, I've heard this name passed around a couple times. Apparently, I've said Blood, Sweat, and Tears a couple times on stream, and people laugh about it. I guess they're talking about this song right here. Uh, what do you say we give it a shot? Oh, and if you guys are new, uh, please consider liking and subscribing. Let's get into it. Here we go. This is a long one. This is like six minutes. All right. A lot of these songs are like three minutes. <laughs> Smacks him. <laughs> I thought he was going to hit him again. Who rides a bike in a museum, by the way? I'm pretty sure you can't do that. What's up with the... What's up with the binoculars, man? He is mesmerized by that painting. Well, I don't even know what the painting is. It looks, looks kind of religious, and the choir you hear in the background is giving me kind of like this churchy type of feel to it. Uh... Jin seems to be absolutely mesmerized by what he's seeing, almost like he's hypnotized by it. You know what it kind of reminds me of? You guys ever see Ghostbusters 2? It's the bad guy's name in Ghostbusters 2. Uh, is it Vigor? The painting that comes alive and takes over New York City and causes lots of problems? We're not here to talk about Ghostbusters. So let's get back into BTS. We can talk about Ghostbusters later if you want, though. It's a good movie. Cool shot. Cool shot. Choreography is pretty insane. What is happening in this video? Okay, before we move on to the next verse here, uh, a lot has happened. I feel like we've, we've been through a lot together already. Um, I already touched on the fact that this video feels kind of oddly religious. But it also feels kind of oddly sexual. Yeah. Uh, it seems like RM is almost like trying to seduce us. 
<laughs> a little bit, right? I mean, you're talking about chocolate and all that stuff. Um, it's say I don't know. Just it kind of had that vibe to it. He did call them devil wings, though. I know this this song is supposed to touch on temptation in one way or another. Um, so maybe that's kind of what he's getting at. Also, I really dig the look. I don't know if this is like a new era of like what they look like. Uh, they, they're constantly changing their hair and, and stuff like that. And I don't know anything about any of that stuff. Uh, I'm just saying I appreciate this particular look. It looks a little bit more mature. Uh, I dig it for sure. It feels artsy. Feels kind of creepy. Feels kind of sexual. Feels kind of religious. What an odd combination. Let's take this one back. I think we're about to get into some, uh, some kind of hook here. Yeah, this is sexual, dude. <laughs> I can't wait to see the choreography video. Who just jumped? Who just jumped? Who was that? I couldn't quite see. That wasn't Sugar, was it? He's like smiling as he's jumping off the thing. Oh man, I can't really see. It's too quick. I don't think it's Sugar. But he is, anyway, he jumps off and he's smiling as he's doing it. Hmm. That's, hmm. This scene makes me think. Why would he be happy to jump? It's a song about temptation. What are they trying to say here? It's so visually cool. I'm seeing a lot of that. I'm seeing a lot of hands over the eyes. He's talking about closing it. Like, I'm seeing the blindfold. He's talking about putting hands over his eyes. I know this ties into the BU some way, and my brain is kind of going crazy just trying to think about how this fits into the whole storyline. I'm just not smart enough to figure it all out just yet. It means I don't even know yet to me. Um, but I'm seeing a lot of that kind of recurring theme. Also, what's up with the ceiling there? What is this thing? What is, what is that? Is that just the ceiling? It's almost like the room might be upside down. Maybe? No. No, because the lights are facing that way. Whatever, let's keep going. Yeah, blindfolded, your hands over the eyes. He's holding it, yeah. That has something to do with something, I guarantee it. He too was a tempter. He too was a link to the second. The evil world with which I no longer wanted to have anything to do. What? Church organ? What is happening here? Yeah, look at, okay, so he's in a robe. Super cash. This is creepy, dude. What does this mean? I got an angel. That is creepy. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Maybe he's in the painting. 
What? No. And he's got the scars on his back? And the smirk? What? Jesus Christ, man! <laughs> what does this mean? <laughs> what is this? What is happening? I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Oh my god. Why would he kiss it? This is so creepy. He's got the scars on his back like his wings ripped off. <laughs> the smirk. <laughs>crying colors he's taking the blinds fold off if he's crying colors could too no let me look at the big screen Dude, something happened with with uh, Jin in that painting, for sure. I think he got sucked in there somehow, and then he kissed the angel, and now he's just a shell of himself. He's like a porcelain man. Look at that. Look at that. His skin is cracking. His skin, you need some moisturizer. Look at his skin. I think his face is like falling apart like it's a statue. This is creepy, man. This is a straight-up horror flick is what this is. This is a straight up horror flick. Something here. I think this is the moment here where like he just gets sucked into this like other dimension, just like other world into the painting. Something has to do with the holding each other's eyes. Let me turn this down. Let's talk a little bit about this video. All right. First off, this is one of the coolest videos I've seen from the guys. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Awesome shots here as well. Everything seems a little bit dulled down, a little bit muted. Um, I really enjoy this kind of era of looks the guys have, too. Um, like I said, I don't know anything about, you know, style. Uh, you, you, I wear the same black shirt for every reaction. Come on, guys. Like, <laughs> I don't know anything about style, uh, but I can appreciate it. You know, they're constantly changing their hair color and hair and, you know, just do and whatnot. They definitely have more of a kind of like matured look in this one, which, you know, I can get down with. They seem older. Super dramatic here as well. Yeah, I dig it, man. I dig it. <laughs> Look at all sultry and shit. <laughs> Feels sexual. It's almost like robotic, but smooth. Yeah, he's up high. He's up high. I can't get a good look at his face. Possibly V. I'm really looking forward to seeing this choreography video as well. Huh. All right, let me uh, turn this down a little bit. Let's talk about this one as well, because this is by far the most artsy music video I've seen from these guys. Uh, it's it's interesting. It's interesting. It's like, I don't want to say it's not colorful because it does get colorful at parts. There's these random splashes of color that I think mean something. I think it's tied to the BU, like or those seven videos in some way or another. Um, and it's religious, it's sexual, it's creepy, and I'm not even talking about the song. I, I guess it's an okay song. But the video is what's doing it for me, guys, you know? This is the best part, though. Maybe you just—I need to listen to it a couple times. This is the first time I've heard it. Maybe it just needs to grow on me. Not that I have like any problem with the song. I just don't th see anything overly special about you know the the dynamics of it. You know, it, from stuff I've heard in the past. However, however, this is a really artsy, very cool, uh, creepy video. I'm not sure what any of this means. But it is definitely, yeah, that's supposed to be blood there. You know what it is? I think the video is too good that it's like overshadowing the song. 
I don't know, guys. I have more questions than answers on this one. This is Blood, Sweat, and Tears from the album Wings. Like I said, this Sunday, I'm going to be doing a live album reaction to the entire album from start to finish. And um, yeah, I'm excited to get into that. People really want me to check out Wings. And the little snippets of songs that I heard today has got me very excited about it. Uh, this song is very catchy, for sure. Um, I just... Um, Maybe I'm just more confused by everything that's going on. It's hard for me to kind of absorb all of the things happening and read uh, the subtitles. I, I've already said, yeah, it's it's sexually religious and creepy. <laughs> but I dig that kind of thing. I dig that kind of thing. I can't wait to get the choreography. Something's up with these color bombs. But yeah, so I'm gonna be doing the reaction then. Uh, if you enjoyed yourself today, please consider liking and subscribing. Also, I have a couple community links down below. You might wanna check out. One's the community Discord. Uh, that's where, you know, me and the crew all hang out and that's where you're gonna get a sneak peek as to where these reactions are going, where this channel's going, what's going on with me. Uh, check out the Discord if you wanna be part of that. And uh, yeah, I think that's gonna do it for me today. This reaction leaves me with more questions than answers. Yeah, that's all I got to say about that. You guys have yourself a fantastic night. Bye, everybody.